In this 4-minute videos for developers, we're going to see how to export import API proxies between the organizations or within the organization using management APIs. Myself, Anand Sakar, I work at Google and Apache platform. Prerequisites for this video, you need an Apache Edge account, you can sign up at apache.com slash edge. You need basic concepts of Apache API proxy, for that you can refer earlier 4-minute videos. As you know, you can create API proxies in Apache Edge using the UI, but you can do a lot more than UI using management APIs. Every feature in Apache Edge that you see in UI is actually exposed as an API. Using APIs, you can able to do a lot more things easily from your local machine or from Postman or from curl, curl or using any other client tool so that you can extend Apache Edge platform and integrate with your SDLC lifecycle. In this demo, we're going to see how to export an API proxy and then how to import an API proxy to existing API or to a new API proxy that you want to create in Apache Edge. Let's see how it works. As you know, when you create an API proxy, it's actually a bundle of XML files and folders that you can export and download it to your local machine. You can able to do that using UI as well as you can able to do that using management APIs. In earlier four minute videos, we have seen how to do it using UI. In this four minute video, we will see how to do same using management APIs. When you download the API proxy, it's actually a zip file that you can again upload back to the Apache Edge uh, after modifications or into a new organization. Let's see how it works in action. We're going to create a simple API to demonstrate this capability. I'm going to first create the API using the UI. So I click on API proxies, click on plus proxy button to create a new proxy, choose reverse proxy and then click on next. I'm going to give the name as uh, export import uh, demo and base path as slash v1 slash ei iphone mock. Give the existing API as uh, mock target dot uh, and then click next, choose defaults, pass through and then click next to default build and deploy. Once API proxy is created, let's uh, access the API proxy. As you can see, this is the proxy endpoint. When you make an API call, you get simple response like hello guest. Let's click on develop and uh, let's see different options. As you can see in the UI, you can actually download the revision. That means you can export a revision, but you can able to do the same thing from command line. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna use the management APIs to do that. You can find a list of uh, management APIs in Apache Docs. So we're gonna use management API export API proxy. As you can see, I'm making a simple API call using curl command. I specified the management API endpoint as well as my org name followed by the API name and the revision number. Let's make an API call. As you can see, the API proxy got downloaded. Let's uh, see the contents of the file. As you can see, there is an EI F1 demo run chip. Let's unzip it. As you can see, there is a default uh, uh, target endpoint and proxy endpoint, as well as uh, the API proxy XML itself. You can uh, find all these three files in Apache Edge. Similarly, you can use this particular uh, proxy bundle and you can upload and create a new API proxy. Let's see how to do that. As you can see here, I'm making a simple curl call with the uh, post as a HTTP method. I have specified uh, the exported uh, zip file uh, in the file option and I have given the endpoint followed by the org name. We are going to import uh, the API proxy into Amar iPhone Demo 29. And action is called import and name of the proxy EI iPhone Demo. Let's make an API call. As you can see, the API got successfully executed and let's take a look at our API that should be present in Amar Demo 29. Go to API proxies, then you should see a new API called EI iPhone Demo. As you can see, EI iPhone Demo got created automatically uh, from the management API that we have given as a command line in the R Amadamo internet. That's how you export and import uh, the API proxies using management APIs in Apache Edge. If you have any questions, please feel free to post your questions in community.apache.com. Thank you for watching this video and uh, subscribe to YouTube channel and share this video with your friends and colleagues. If you have any feedback uh, regarding these videos, please uh, drop a comment uh, below the video.